Fatty liver disease is a condition where too much fat builds up in your liver. Your liver is an important organ that helps your body process food and remove toxins. When fat accumulates, it can lead to inflammation and damage over time. There are two main types of fatty liver disease, alcoholic fatty liver disease, or AFLD, and non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, or NAFLD. AFLD is caused by excessive alcohol consumption, while NAFLD is linked to factors like obesity, diabetes, and high cholesterol. In its early stages, fatty liver disease might not cause any noticeable symptoms. You might not even know you have it. However, as fat continues to build up in your liver, it can lead to fatigue, discomfort in the upper right abdomen, and even yellowing of the skin or eyes. Over time, fatty liver disease can progress to more serious conditions like non-alcoholic statohepatitis, or NASH, cirrhosis, and even liver failure. NASH is a more aggressive form of fatty liver disease characterized by inflammation and liver cell damage. Imagine your liver as a hard-working factory, diligently processing everything you eat and drink. When too much fat builds up, it's like clogging the factory's machinery with grease. This makes it harder for your liver to function properly, leading to a buildup of toxins and waste products in your body. Excess fat in the liver also triggers inflammation, which is your body's natural response to injury or irritation. While some inflammation is normal, chronic inflammation in the liver can cause scarring and permanent damage over time, leading to conditions like cirrhosis. In its early stages, fatty liver disease often doesn't cause any noticeable symptoms. This makes it even more important to be aware of the risk factors and to talk to your doctor if you have any concerns. As the condition progresses, you may experience fatigue, a feeling of fullness or discomfort in the upper right abdomen, and unexplained weight loss. In more advanced stages, symptoms can include yellowing of the skin or eyes, also known as jaundice, swelling in the legs or abdomen, and confusion. Section 5. When your liver needs help, foods to avoid. Understanding what foods to avoid can make a significant difference in managing your liver health. If you have fatty liver disease, making changes to your diet is crucial for managing the condition and preventing further damage to your liver. A well-balanced diet can help reduce liver fat, inflammation, and fibrosis. It's not just about what you eat, but also about what you avoid. Certain foods can worsen inflammation and fat buildup, so it's best to limit or avoid them altogether. By being mindful of your food choices, you can take proactive steps to support your liver's health and function. Here are some key culprits to watch out for. These foods can be particularly harmful to your liver and should be consumed in moderation or avoided completely. Sugary drinks, sodas, fruit juices, and sports drinks are loaded with sugar, which your liver converts into fat. Excessive sugar intake can lead to increased fat deposits in the liver, exacerbating fatty liver disease. Opt for water, herbal teas, or other low sugar beverages instead. Processed foods, packaged snacks, fast food, and frozen meals often contain unhealthy fats, added sugars, and artificial ingredients that can harm your liver. These foods are typically high in calories and low in essential nutrients, making them a poor choice for liver health. Focus on whole, unprocessed foods like fruits, vegetables, and whole grains. Red meat. While lean protein is important, red meat is high in saturated fat, which can contribute to fatty liver disease. Instead, choose lean proteins such as chicken, fish, beans, and legumes. These alternatives provide the necessary nutrients without the added risk to your liver. Section 6. Sugar and Sweet Treats – A Recipe for Liver Trouble Sugar is a major culprit in fatty liver disease. When you consume too much sugar, your liver converts it into fat, which can build up in your liver and contribute to inflammation. Here's a breakdown of the sugary treats to avoid, candy and desserts. These are loaded with sugar and often contain unhealthy fats as well. Baked goods, cookies, cakes, and pastries are high in sugar, refined flour, and unhealthy fats. Sweetened beverages, sodas, fruit juices, and sports drinks are major sources of added sugar. Section 7. Fat is not your friend. Limiting unhealthy fats. Not all fats are created equal. While healthy fats are essential for a balanced diet, unhealthy fats can worsen fatty liver disease. Here are the main types of unhealthy fats to limit. Saturated fats. Found in red meat, full-fat dairy products, and processed foods, 
Saturated fats can raise cholesterol levels and contribute to fatty liver disease. Trans fats. These artificial fats are created through a process called hydrogenation and are commonly found in fried foods, baked goods, and processed snacks. Trans fats are particularly harmful to liver health. Section 8. Choosing healthy fats for a happy liver. While it's important to limit unhealthy fats, including healthy fats in your diet is essential for overall health and can even benefit your liver. Here are some healthy fats to embrace. Monounsaturated fats. Found in olive oil, avocados, nuts, and seeds, monounsaturated fats can help improve cholesterol levels and reduce inflammation. Polyunsaturated fats. Omega-3 fatty acids, found in fatty fish like salmon and tuna, and omega-6 fatty acids, found in vegetable oils like corn oil and soybean oil, are essential for cell function and can help reduce inflammation. Section 9. Nourishing your liver foods to embrace. Now that you know which foods to avoid, let's focus on the foods that can help nourish your liver and promote healing. Your liver is a vital organ that plays a crucial role in detoxifying your body, so it's important to support it with the right nutrients. Here are some liver-loving foods to include in your diet. Incorporating these foods into your daily meals can make a significant difference in your liver health and overall well-being. Fruits and vegetables. Packed with antioxidants, vitamins, and minerals, fruits and vegetables help protect your liver from damage and reduce inflammation. Aim to fill half your plate with a variety of colorful produce to ensure you're getting a wide range of nutrients. Whole grains. Whole grains like brown rice, quinoa, and oats are high in fiber, which helps regulate blood sugar levels and improve liver function. Fiber is essential for maintaining a healthy digestive system, which in turn supports liver health. Lean protein. Opt for lean protein sources like chicken, fish, beans, and tofu which provide essential nutrients without the excess saturated fat found in red meat. These proteins are easier for your liver to process and can help repair liver cells. Including a variety of protein sources in your diet ensures you get a balanced intake of amino acids and other vital nutrients. Additionally, consider incorporating green tea into your routine. Green tea is rich in antioxidants, particularly catechins, which have been shown to improve liver function and protect against liver disease. Herbal teas like dandelion root and milk thistle can also support liver health. Finally, don't forget to stay hydrated. Drinking plenty of water helps your liver flush out toxins and keeps your body functioning optimally. Aim for at least eight glasses of water a day to support your liver and overall health. Section 10, fiber your liver's best friend. Fiber is an indigestible carbohydrate that plays a crucial role in digestive health. It is found in plant-based foods such as fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and legumes. Unlike other carbohydrates, fiber isn't broken down into sugar molecules, which means it passes through the body undigested. This unique property of fiber is what makes it so beneficial for our health. For those with fatty liver disease, fiber is particularly beneficial as it helps regulate blood sugar levels, improve insulin sensitivity, and promote healthy cholesterol levels. When you consume fiber-rich foods, they help slow down the digestion and absorption of sugar, which in turn helps to prevent spikes in blood sugar levels. This is crucial for individuals with fatty liver disease, as high blood sugar levels can lead to increased fat storage in the liver. Here's why fiber is your liver's best friend. Fiber has multiple benefits that directly and indirectly support liver health. Slows down sugar absorption. Fiber helps slow down the absorption of sugar into your bloodstream, preventing spikes in blood sugar that can contribute to fat storage in the liver. By maintaining stable blood sugar levels, fiber helps reduce the risk of developing insulin resistance, a condition that can lead to fatty liver disease. Promotes regular bowel movements. Fiber adds bulk to your stool, making it easier to pass and helping your body eliminate waste products efficiently. Regular bowel movements are essential for removing toxins from the body, which can otherwise accumulate and affect liver function. A diet high in fiber ensures that your digestive system works smoothly, reducing the burden on your liver. Supports gut health. A healthy gut microbiome is essential for overall health, including liver function. The gut and liver are closely connected through the gut-liver axis, and a healthy gut can help reduce inflammation and support liver health. Fiber-rich foods promote the growth of beneficial bacteria in the gut, which play a crucial role in maintaining a healthy digestive system. Fiber acts as a prebiotic, feeding the beneficial bacteria in your gut.
These beneficial bacteria help break down fiber into short-chain fatty acids, which have anti-inflammatory properties and can help protect the liver from damage. Including a variety of high-fiber foods in your diet can ensure that your gut microbiome remains balanced and healthy, providing ongoing support for your liver. Section 11. Taking Control of Your Liver Health Managing fatty liver disease starts with making positive lifestyle changes, and diet plays a crucial role in this journey. By understanding which foods to avoid and which ones to embrace, you can take control of your liver health and support its natural healing process. Remember to consult with your doctor or a registered dietitian to create a personalized eating plan that meets your individual needs and health goals. With the right dietary changes and a commitment to a healthy lifestyle, you can improve your liver health and reduce your risk of complications.